<laughs> you freaking out? Totally. Didn't really have time for a run this morning. Gonna do a long run this afternoon. Gonna use this hotel gym for a little exercise. They're picking me up in like four and a half minutes. I gotta, I gotta get out of here. Waiting for me downstairs now. We go to where the event is, which I have not been to yet. And then I, my speaking, my talking, my session is at like 11 o'clock and it's 9.45 right now. So it's, uh, it's go time. I accidentally knocked over a glass last night. It was an accident, these things happen. You guys ready? Yeah, I'm ready. This is like a bigger day for you than it yeah, is for me. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Testing my computer and presentation now, but everything looks on the up and up. See what the, see what the crowd looks like. I'm freaking out. Why? I don't know, man. I'm just freaking out. <laughs> just you want to come on stage with me? No. <laughs> this is the green room. I mean, it's like, it's like white in here, but I always call the room that you hang out in before you go out there, the green room. Regardless of what color it is. I always make it a priority before any talk to have some alone time before I go out on stage for my, for my talk. This coffee cup is a joke because there's always people wanting to talk to you and there's, there's a lot of action going on, a lot of distractions at a time when you need focus the most. There is some irony in the fact that at a time when you need the most focus is the time when there are the most distractions. I'm gonna prepare and then my talk is in like 15 minutes. It's go time. I gotta go talk. <laughs> Can you, can, you, uh, can you take this? Can you take this? Uh, can you mind you know, just, you know, just, just taking this for me? Keep an eye on that while I'm out here. Yeah. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you. You want me to film for you? No, then I'm not using credit. Thank you. Hey, guys. I play movies, like my movies, during my presentation, and they're watching a movie right now. I'm like, 25 minutes into it, it's going pretty well. All right, just about over. I'm playing my last video now. Then we do a questions and answers, and then that's the whole thing's done, that's it. Thanks, guys. How do you think it went? Man, it was amazing. Now I'm not cheating my pants anymore. I'm okay. <laughs> yeah. So you think it went good? You yeah, it like was it. awesome. Man. Okay, awesome. cool. Awesome. I can never tell. Nice to meet you. Thanks a lot. I'll see you later. Thank, Thank you, you so for everything. Much.
see. Oh, this is me. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 Oh, oh, oh. This is this. This was, this was great. It's a really great audience. Yeah, man. And those guys, they really love you. It's just amazing. Yeah, I think it went really well. It's very exciting for me. Yeah. I think that went really, really well. Back at the hotel now for like two seconds. I think we're at lunch now. This place is legit. And it's. He spent like three days there, dressed as a girl. It was amazing. The guy was just really nice. Strong Brazilian lunch. I gotta like go to sleep or take a nap or something. I'm falling apart. If I were ever to be in a superhero movie, the villain, the superhero, the villain for the movie would be some sort of villain that like whose like evil superpower is just email. Email is my arch nemesis. How do you get like 70 emails a day that all require a response? It's the biggest like time vampire like sucking the life out of my neck that exists in my entire career. Sitting in this hotel room doing emails and look what's outside. Oh! I literally ended my presentation this morning to 1,700 people by asking if there were anyone in the audience who wanted to go for a run with me this afternoon. And a guy named Gabriel was like, yeah, I'll take you on a run. This is Gabe. Is it Gabe or Gabriel? Both. Which one do you prefer? Gabriel. Okay, Gabriel, where are you taking, oh, and then this is Jeff. Hey. Where are you taking us running? We going up the mountain to the corners of Belo Horizonte. Belo Horizonte, by the way, means Five. Yeah. Apparently the park is closed. We're gonna run through this neighborhood instead. Uh, am I leaving anything out, guys? No, that's it. That's it. Yeah. All right, here we go. This city is Belo Horizonte. How do you say it? Belo Horizonte. Belo Horizonte. That means beautiful horizon in Portuguese. Isn't that a beautiful horizon? This is the final stretch here. The last like three miles straight uphill. What happened to you? How'd you get a ride in a cop car? Ooh, coconut. Thank you. <laughs> what, the cops just said? No, it's just like, hey, my gringo friend left me. Did you guys give me a ride? You're like, come on, man. Really? <laughs> In the end, we got like six miles, four coconuts. You end up riding a cop car. This is your mom's car? Yeah. I feel bad for her. This car's going to stink when you give it back. Oh, my God, man. You know how bad if you put that in a vlog and one of my brothers show her? <laughs> this car right now smells like a middle school locker room. Open the windows. Stinks in here. Open the windows. God. Thank you. Thank you. Good run. Right. Maybe I'll see you later. Yeah. Maybe? All right, take care, nice. guys. It's late. I'm tired. I'd like to just take it easy for the rest of the night. I just wanted to take a nap. All right. Never had to wear this much safety gear to go go-karting before and it's all broken. These neck collars are mandatory. Also mandatory, gloves. Uh, 
I just noticed something kind of curious, which is that my fuel cap is not on the fuel tank. Don't worry guys, I got this. These, uh, these goofballs here, they're all Brazilian YouTubers. They make like soccer, like football videos. Camera. I just want to share one thing with you. Now, you know I'm no stickler for safety. I ride an electric skateboard through the streets of New York City. But there has to be a line, and this go-kart track crosses that line. This hairpin turn right here, if you overshoot the turn, you go and you crash into a concrete corner. That's it. Look. And these things are gas powered, they'll just explode. Did you guys get dizzy? Yeah. How was it? <laughs> I'm dizzy. Uh, strong as a boo. Strong as a bull, man. <laughs> he uh, he always wears this mask, so don't be don't be scared. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll link his channel below if you want. <laughs> yeah. you're, if you're curious. <laughs> Dead last. Three laps behind. I tried. <laughs> I tried. I was getting dizzy out there, man. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go. Bye guys. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. I'll see you on the internet. Thanks, man. It's good That's to meet so you. Awesome. Good to meet you, man. Yeah, I'll see you later. Alright, till next time guys. I haven't really eaten all day. What an awesome time in Brazil. All right, all packed up. <sighs> Goodbye, fabulous hotel room. It is now 11.35 p.m. and I'm headed to the airport.